Shorty ate up on my body, put him in the sky, it won't even witness uh, Send that nigga to the dental, uh, for thinking that nigga's pretending I got 52 shots in his back with an infrared up on the upper feet let off Straight to be on the top, that don't take Hey, what is up guys, it's your brother Sam with one back with another video And on today's video, I'm going to be showcasing every game pass on Beyond I don't know if you guys heard about the new Naruto game that's coming up with the same creators that made Beyond, which is going to be called Shinobi Life 2. Basically a revamp of their most successful Naruto game out yet, which is Shinobi Life. They mentioned that the game passes from the previous Naruto games will be implemented into their new game, Shinobi Life 2. I think. I mean, don't take my word for it, but they might implement Click the first link in the description and join my Discord. If you haven't yet, cop up my merch. Click the merch link in the description. It'll take you straight to my merch page. Cop up. I'm planning to host a giveaway. I don't know what I'm going to end up giving away. It might be Robux. It might be something else. Once I check if it's okay for me to give out Robux and I get the green lights to give out Robux, then there's a good chance that I'm going to end up giving out Robux. But who knows? If I don't get the green light, the giveaway might be something else. If you guys want to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is like the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and turn on notifications. And last but not least, leave a comment in the comment section below. You can comment anything, but make sure you have this hashtag in your comment. Hashtag giveaway. If you have that hashtag in your comment and you like the video and you subscribe to the channel, then you will automatically be entered in the giveaway. Met some Beyond Game Passes into Shinobi Life 2. But for a fact, they're definitely going to implement Shinobi Life Game Passes into Shinobi Life 2. If you played their previous games like me, like Beyond and Shinobi Life, and you enjoyed their previous games and ended up buying Game Passes, then you won't be spending a lot of money and you won't be having to buy certain game passes on Shinobi Life 2. So Shinobi Life 2 won't be a pay to win game to you as much as it would be a pay to win game to new players who didn't play their old Naruto games. Cause they'll have to buy the game passes and you won't because you already bought them in the old Naruto games when they were popping. This video does good. I might do a video showcasing all the Shinobi Life game passes. And if you guys wanna see that kind of video, let me know in the comment section below, and I promise you, I'll have that video up by next week, if you guys really want it. With that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright, so we're going to start off by showcasing the Akoski um, Game Pass. So the Game Pass costs about 899 Robux, and it's called Akoski Membership. And this Game Pass allows you to, I remember this Game Pass allowed me to go into that uh, Akoski hideout, and there you get scrolls early. So you have to wait a couple hours for an NBC to spawn where you get a scroll from him. And the scrolls that the Akoski members end up giving you, you get them early if you have this game pass because the NBC spawn early inside the hideout. And the only way you can get in the hideout is if you have this game pass. But keep in mind, they also spawn outside the hideout. So you could still get the scrolls without having this game pass, but it's just going to take you a minute. You know, it's going to take a while for them to spawn outside instead of inside. Inside, they spawn way faster. And that's what makes this game pass kind of, you know, important and nice all right so let's read the description some of this content has been created uh this will remain a pre-order until the full content of the game pass has been created so technically this game pass isn't fully done uh they might if they implement this in the shinobi life 2 game they should they should and there's a good chance they will but yeah if they do implement it they're definitely gonna add more features onto this game pass access to akoski base like i said you get you get to access the hideout the akoski base um, if you have this game pass, Akoski title, oh I did not know that, so you get Akoski title as well, and access to exclusive Akoski members, Jutsu's Forbidden Scroll Spawns, so the Jutsu's and Forbidden Scroll Spawns, you can still get them, even if you don't have this game pass, but it's just going to be a little bit more difficult, uh, you can unlock slash find the Akoski Forbidden Scrolls in game for free, but they spawn rate is extremely rare, you get access to better spawns, yeah like I said, better spawns, the Akoski Forbidden Scrolls spawn in the Akoski base, by every two hours so they change it so every two hours all the akoski forbidden scrolls spawn in there that's dope so if you have this game pass you can get all the akoski forbidden scrolls in two hours if you wait two hours they all spawn in there but outside i don't think they spawn in two hours each nbc that gives a specific scroll spawns at a different time so it's going to be way difficult for you to get all the forbidden scrolls if you don't have this game pass once you're in game head this way follow me listen Here's the base. So, if you happen to buy the Koski Game Pass, you'll be able because of Shaka Walk. All right. Um. Bro, 
Is it glitched? Two thousand years later. All right, so it's Loki glitched, boys. So every time you, okay, never mind. Okay, my my trucker walk just deactivated. Let's see if I can exit. Okay, let me try to get in. Okay, see, for some reason, look, every time I deactivate my chakra walk, it activates again as soon as I land on water. So the only way you can get in here is by deactivating it and jumping right away and then clicking. And uh, clicking the right click on your mouse. And yeah, you just keep doing that over and over until you get lucky and get in there. Okay, bros, if you're watching this video, you need to fix this ASAP. Alright, so as you can see, it just worked. But yeah, other than that, you should be able to get in this, uh, in the Akoski base if you bought the game pass. Oh yeah, in this base, every two hours, all the Akoski Forbidden Scrolls spawn in here. So yeah, you can easily get all the Akoski Forbidden Scrolls if you have the game pass by coming in here every two hours. If you don't have enough Robux to afford the game pass, you can easily get the, not easily, but you could still get the, for, uh, the Akoski Forbidden Scrolls. They spawn uh, around the base. Uh, one spawns somewhere over here. And I forgot where the other one spawns. Just check out YouTube videos on where they spawn. Um, but yeah, they spawn at random times, I believe. So you gotta wait a really long time. But if you have the game pass, you won't have to wait a long time. Just two hours and you can get all of them. Simple. And also, I forgot to mention, they all spawn at different times. If you're getting them from outside, they don't spawn every two hours. The, the ones that spawn every two hours are the ones that spawn in the base, not outside. All right, just had to get that out of the way. All right, next up is the Shadow Clone Combat Game Pass. This game pass costs 399 Robux. And what this game pass simply does, it makes your combat a bit stronger. So when you're fighting other players, hand to hand combat, I believe, it spawns clones that help you fight the other player and do more damage to the other player. So that's what basically this uh, this game pass does. That's all. So um, with that being said, let me read the description and then I'll show you how this game pass functions in game. So this has been created for Alpha, how to use this remake. This changes your regular combat system to use clones to fight alongside you instead. Think of it like the Storm games, Naruto combat. This is not Clone Jutsu. Clone Jutsu is free in game. But yeah, keep in mind guys, Clone Jutsu is free. Alright boys, so I don't think this game pass is working for some reason. Because, like I said, when you're in combat, clones of you are supposed to spawn right next to you and help you fight the opponent, the enemy you're, or target that you're attacking. So yeah, no clones are spawning and helping me. So yeah, I don't know what's wrong with the game pass. I think it's bugged. So care okay, bros, if you're watching this video, fix this. All right guys, check it out. So this video was posted two years ago, April 24th, 2018. Test game pass shadow clones combat. So he's basically showcasing the shadow clone combat game pass. So this is how the game pass is supposed to function. You see, when he's using combat and attacking it, NBC or whoever you're attacking, doesn't matter who you're attacking, clones spawn and help you attack your opponent or target. And that's not what was happening with me, which basically means this game pass is currently broken. So care bros, fix this. <laughs> All right, third game pass cost 99 robux i'm not really sure there's a good chance that this game pass might not be implemented into the shinobi life 2 game the new upcoming Naruto game because i don't think there's gonna be elements that you get that you could select while spinning i'm not really sure i'm not really sure don't take my word for it but that's what i think this game pass costs 99 robux not bad so this game pass just allows you to pick an extra element so if you don't have this game pass you can only select two elements if you end up buying this game pass you can select up to three elements and honestly in my opinion this game pass you do not need all right so with this game pass basically allows you to do like i said is select three elements as you can see i have three elements selected instead of two if you don't have this game pass then you won't be able to select three elements so you can check it's like three elements um if you don't have this game pass try selecting three elements it won't allow you so yeah if you want to select three elements get this game pass it's not that expensive it's 99 robux but honestly in my opinion you don't need it you honestly don't next up is the wear custom clothing game pass um you should already know what this game pass does just by the title it allows you to wear custom clothing and so if you don't have this game pass you have to pick clothes in game but if you have this game pass you can literally rock any clothing any clothing in game or outside game all right so this is how the wear custom clothing game pass functions and fun fact it's one of my favorite game passes because it allowed me to rock my fire merch in game 
if you guys haven't got my fire merch which is the clothing that i have on right now go cop it right now click the merch link in the description go to the description of the video and click the merch link and it's gonna take you straight to the merch cop the merch that you think looks fire that being said go to the clothing store and if you have this game pass it would allow you to wear any clothing so if you want to wear a custom shirt that's not in game get the id once you get the id paste it in the shirt tab same goes for the pants if you want to wear certain pants that's not in game go to the to the link of the pants and make sure you copy the id always get the id and paste it here paste the id and for the shirt that you want to rock and the pants that you want to rock and then click wear once you click wear you should be able to equip it and then just hop in game boom that's custom clothing right there so yeah that's what this game pass basically allows you to do is wear custom clothing last but not least the kg inventory bag i made a whole video explaining how this game pass functions so once you buy this game pass you get a bag on the right corner of your kg tab so every time you go to the kg tab and spin for a kg on the right corner there will be a bag and every time you spin and get a certain kg it would automatically save into the bag if you guys want to know more about this game pass go check out my video that i made dedicated to this game pass go check out that video but yeah with that being said i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i really hope this video ended up being helpful and if it did, please smash that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel and turn on notifications for more fire content. It's been your boy, the summer to one. Peace out.